the problem. The scientific establishment refuses any consideration of the supernatural. The result is that when mainstream science and religion deal with the same topic, there will be conflict, with the exception of atheism, which denies the supernatural. This conflict is most evident in Origins research. The denial of the supernatural eliminates all consideration of God, so God is excluded before any evidence is even considered. Furthermore, any attempt to include any intelligent involvement in Origins is fought passionately. This makes the scientific establishment actively antagonistic to biblical creation. It has been removed from consideration before any evidence is considered. The scientific establishment is clearly at fault in this. They exclude God and the supernatural from the start before evidence is even looked at. No consideration of intelligent involvement in origins is allowed, and they are antagonistic towards those who violate these rules. A prime example of this is the treatment of Richard Sternberg, who is a devout evolutionist. As the editor of the Proceedings of the Biological Society of Washington, in 2004, he authorized the publication of a paper by Dr. Stephen Meyer that had passed peer review, entitled The Origin of Biological Information in the Higher Taxonomic Categories. It presented scientific evidence for intelligent design in biology. As a result, he was persecuted by both the Smithsonian and the National Center for Science Education. So it's a safe bet that no other editor will risk the same fate by publishing an intelligent design friendly paper. The real controversy is that by refusing any consideration of God, the scientific establishment is pushing atheism. So the real controversy is not science versus religion, nor is it creation versus evolution. The real controversy is atheism versus theism. More specifically, it is atheism versus the Bible. In conclusion, the scientific establishment refuses any consideration of God. No dissent on this is tolerated. They have effectively declared war on God. The controversy results from the refusal of theists to bow the knee to atheism.